For 12 long years, this woman had been bleeding. For 12 long years. And I want y'all to know something. That, 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 that because of where she was and of what was going on in her life, not only that, she had been ostracized. Yeah. She hang out around folk. Y'all know how uh, what the law required because of her blood issues. Uh, she couldn't be around people. Mm -hmm. But she knew Jesus had her deliverance. Yeah. Desperation. Determination. And she was healed that very hour. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Now I want y'all to know something. Every time I, I read that text, thank you, Lord. The servants came to Jairus and they said, Jairus, you can tell Jesus, don't bother. Because your daughter is no longer sick. Now, I want y'all to be real with me for a minute. And I heard to my clothes. I want y'all to be real with me just for a minute. Jesus was on the way to your house mm. to do something at your house. Mm -hmm. Somebody interrupted him on the way to your house. And that daughter that was sick is not dead. <laughs> <laughs> Some of us would have lost what little bit of religion we had. Amen. <laughs> Y'all know it's the truth. Yeah, amen. amen. Some of us would have been irate with Jesus. Some of us would have called Jesus all kind of names. Can I, can I get a witness? Amen. And not only would you have called his names, but you would have got on your cell phone and got your, your Facebook buddies to call his name with you. Can I get a witness? <laughs> so why is it that Jairus could, could just be patient? Why is it that Jairus could just hold on? I don't know about you, but let me tell you something that I'm always reminded of. But every time I go down the road and I see a car with a paper tag on it, every time I pass a house and I see a soul sign in the yard, every time I see somebody that's getting dismissed from the hospital, Every time I see somebody that's been blessed with a new job, every time I see somebody that's got a praise on their lips and a shout in their heart, I'm reminded, I believe it in my spirit. I don't know what you see, but I believe Jared looked at Jesus as he healed this woman with the issue of blood. And I heard him say, I believe it in my spirit. He said, well, that lets me know that he's still in the blessing. Yes. Yeah. Somebody ought to hear When you see somebody get up on their feet, you ought to pray to God. Because it lets you know he's still in the blessing. Yes, he is. When you see somebody drop a man you ought to rejoice because you know he's still in the blessed bit. And I believe in my 
Glory to your name, God. Glory to your name, God. My, my. <laughs> my, my. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Mm. Mm. I want you to know something. Mm. This tablecloth. Mm. Mm -hmm. This right here represents the hem of his garment. All right now. All right now. All right. I don't know whether anybody ever told you that. Mm. But this represents the mm. hem mm. of his garment. Amen. Communion mm. is not just an opportunity mm. yeah. that we break the bread Amen. and drink the wine. But it's an opportunity for us to touch something that happened 2,000 years ago. Yeah. Mm. Do we realize that? That this is a momentous occasion. Mm. <clears throat> because it was this meal mm. that assured my blessings. Yes. Mm -hmm. Tell y'all something. I'm gonna be healed one day. Oh yes, oh yes, you heal now. You heal now. You heal now. You heal now. Thank God. Man, man. You know something? If I turn this way, I'm next in line. <laughs> And if I turn this way, you're next in line. I'm still next in line. Yeah. I believe that my blessings are sure. Yes. Yeah. That's why I can come to the table. Mm. We don't come to this table with apprehensions. Yes. We don't come to this table not believing what he can do. Mm. Because just as we talked about this morning, he is our friend. Yes. yes. He can do whatever he decides to do, whenever he decides to do it. Those folk decided that if I go ahead and tell Jesus uh, to cancel coming, tell him don't worry about coming. Hallelujah. Mm. Because Jairus, your daughter is dead. Yes. The situation is beyond anybody's help. Yes. Mm. Stop letting anybody in on your prayer life. <laughs> say that. Say that. Now, now I know, I know, I know y'all gonna say that I hate Facebook. But some of y'all put stuff on Facebook. Ain't got no business. Ain't got no business. Amen. 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 Hmm. <laughs> Everybody that put on your page that hmm. they praying for you, mm -mm. it ain't what you think. Amen. Jesus had to dismiss some of the crowd, didn't he? Mm -hmm. He said, James, y'all, y'all, come on, go with me. The rest of y'all dismissed. Yeah. He shut the door. Uh -huh. Ain't that part of his instruction? Mm -hmm. that, 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 that he has a way of seeing in secret. Mm -hmm. And what he sees in secret, he he's going to reward you openly. Yes. Don't tell everybody about what you're going through. Don't tell everybody what you need. Yes. Yes. <laughs> I want y'all to know there's a part of this thing I haven't even told them anything. <laughs> Keep it real. There's a part of this thing that if I tell her, she probably wouldn't go back to sleep. 
I told nobody but the Lord. Amen. Amen. Desperation. Determination. Determination. Will lead you to your deliverance. Mm. Mm. If I had to put it another way, I would say, White Oak, if you get serious about God, God will get serious about yeah. you. If you want out of that man, you get serious about it. Mm. If you want your healing, you get serious about it. Amen. I had a friend that tell me the other day, he said, uh, Pastor, you got to pray for me. Uh, uh, doctor done told me I got a high blood pressure, but I just love sausage. <laughs> 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 I said, when you decide to love sausages, but let me know then I'll start praying. <laughs> <laughs> I'm supposed to pray while I need the sausage. That don't make sense. <laughs> yeah. See, a lot of us, we want somebody to do it for us. Amen? Mm -hmm. We don't want to touch him ourselves. We want somebody to touch Jesus mm -hmm. for us. Amen? Amen? I'll pray with you, but you have to start out praying for yourself. Amen. 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 I want somebody to know this day. That if we come to the table, <coughs> is an opportunity for us to touch Jesus. For well, he said, do this in remembrance of me. Yeah. The commemoration is a dedication and it's a devotion. Mm -hmm. Today, as we come to the Lord's table, I want us to do something different. We're going to ask you to dig this.